Hello, this is Nick from ReviewOutloud.com. Today I'm going to show you a block pressure sensor issue I'm having. So if I look at my port engine right here, uh, it's doing 71 PSI. My starboard engine is throwing 390 PSI. Now, the engines are off, <laughs> so um, it's very strange for it to be coming up with that. And my starboard engine over here, what's happening is after intermittently it comes up with a block pressure sensor error um, and it actually slows the engine down to below a thousand rpms so what we got here and this is the merc cruiser 350 mag engine but i got here is this part this is um basically the sensor and this is the part number right here and we're going to basically replace the bad sensor put this guy in and see if that fixes the the error and this is a uh, original part it cost about 130 bucks i'll put a link in the show notes to where i got this guy reviewoutlaw.com new videos every thursday at 3 p.m subscribe today so all you really need is an adjustable because you don't want to go whatever you do do not tighten this thing too much see how it looks like this big diesel you know thing when you put the wrench on here but look how small those threads are so do not and i repeat make sure you do it by hand so it's not cross-threaded and then put it in and just snug it a little. So it doesn't, you know, you don't want it stripping out. And where it is, I'll show you. Back here, I'm behind the engine. Now, what I did was I went directly, here's the engine, went directly behind it. If you can get a roof up, it's much easier to see. Go back here and you'll see, you'll see the big hose here. You unplug this right here and you'll see the sensor is right there in the hose. And I'm just gonna unplug that, put the new one in, and plug this in, it's that easy. Look at the two, you see this is the old one, versus the new one. I mean, it's no wonder the thing is giving us errors here. It's pretty beat up and old, so. Plug the new one in, Let's see uh, what the re readout is. I'm gonna keep this though as a spare, you know. Because sometimes there's just stuff in it. Sometimes you get some stuff and you can actually just clean out this area right here with some water and actually starts working again. So I would recommend keeping these old ones as spares. All right, so replace the sensor. This is the original sensor 68 on the port. And then starboard now is, went from 400 down to three. And that's because when we took it off, it lost all the pressure. So when we turn this guy on, it should go up to its normal steady temperature. So let's turn them on. First, can turn the blower on. Give a little couple seconds for that. And let's turn on. Uh, just keeping an eye on it. Jumped up to about 50, 60 psi. And let's do my port. So my port engine's got about 120. So I'm gonna keep an eye on that and see if it builds up on the starboard engine to about 120. I'm not getting any errors or beeps and it's a heck of a lot better than 400. So uh, I'm just gonna keep a close eye on that though and I will update you. Hey, I really appreciate you watching this video. If you have time, please give me a thumbs up, share the video on Facebook or social media, click that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell icon next to the subscribe button so you get a notification when new videos come out. Finally, you leave me a comment. I love those. Really appreciate it. Have a great day, guys.